Hello dear fans. How many stars are there in the sky? The night sky, dotted with tiny luminous points of stars, is a mesmerizing sight. Even with the strongest visual acuity, the human eye is able to notice an insignificant part of them. If the observer is on the illuminated streets of a large city, the number of visible stars is reduced to several dozen. Optical instruments that reduce the distance to the stars, binoculars, amateur and powerful professional telescopes reveal an endless series of celestial bodies. To the naked eye, far from the lights of big cities, about 2,000 stars open. This is one-third of the total visible in the two hemispheres of the planet. Out of sight are the stars of the opposite hemisphere and those that are located near the horizon where the transparency of the atmosphere decreases. Stars named The brightest and largest stars have several names, each people of the Earth gave them their own names. The names of about 300 of them have survived to our times, with Sumerian, Akkadian, Coptic, Semitic, Greek, Roman, and, of course, Arabic roots. However, on the maps of the starry sky, the luminaries are indicated by the letters of the Greek alphabet, with belonging to the constellation. The lower the brightness of the star, the further from the beginning of the alphabet the letter denoting it. The star Deneb, tail in Arabic, the alpha of the Cygnus constellation, has several namesakes from the constellation Cetus, Deneb Kaidos, Leo, Denebola, Scorpio, Deneb Crab, Dolphin, and Eagle. About two dozen are named after the astronomers who discovered or described them. These are Barnard's flying star in the constellation Ophiuchus and Captain's star in the constellation Painter, invisible to the naked eye and discovered using powerful optical devices. Herschel's garnet star in the constellation Cepheus is available for observations in the Northern Hemisphere. The names of astronomers Van Maanen, Krzyminski, PRZYBYLSKY, Popper, Luton, Tigarden also accompany the mention of the stars they described. However, this list is unofficial. It is hard to remember how many pioneers in other fields of science share the same modesty. Cunning founders of companies offering to name a star after someone who wants to pay money for it successfully make money out of thin air. There will be no information about the name in the official star atlases, and only two parties will know about the existence of the certificate of assigning a new name to the star, the one who paid and accepted the payment. Unnamed Stars After about 6,000 stars visible to the naked eye, there are objects distinguishable through binoculars. With this increase, the number of stars rises to 200,000, according to the magnitude system developed by the ancient Greek astronomer Hipparchus of Nicaea and improved today. These are stars of magnitude 9 to 10. Stars 11 to 12 magnitudes are visible through the eyepiece of a modest amateur telescope, and their number rises to 2 million. A powerful telescope can distinguish objects up to 15 to 16 magnitudes, increasing their number by more than 100 million. It is believed that the number of stars up to magnitude 20 is in the tens of billions. However, not all of them are in constant visual accessibility, through telescopes, of course, periodically covering themselves with clouds of cosmic dust. How many stars are still at a greater distance can be found out only approximately. The most powerful telescope of the Earth, a complex of four main and four auxiliary optical telescopes, operates in the Atacama Desert, Chile. It is called that Very Large Telescope, or VLT. According to astronomers' estimates, the Milky Way galaxy, the one where our Earth is located, is about a trillion stars, according to other estimates, about 200 billion. However, there are many galaxies in space, about a trillion, and this one is only in the so-called visible region of the universe. Thanks for watching.